Hello everyone, my name is Matt, and this is another reaction video. Uh, I've been wanting to know Tom McKay, who, who, who is Henry in this game. I wanted to know a little bit more about this, and I've been meaning to also watch this video. I've been meaning to watch a lot of these videos, so I might as well watch them with you guys. Because I know you guys have probably watched them before, you watched every single one of them. I never got around to them, so I might as well come around and watch them with everybody else, and you guys can see what I think of it. I've wanted to see Tom McKay as Henry because uh I always like seeing behind the scenes stuff and if there's any other things that uh that are, that are non spoilerish I haven't watched this so I don't know if there may be spoilers or not I don't think there would be uh cuz this was released before the game was uh put out but I always love seeing like who who voices who who is the person in the game uh and it's always been nice for me it's the same thing with uh in Mass Effect, if you know uh, Admiral Hackett, uh, Lance Hendrickson voiced him, and I love Lance Hendrickson. Like, he's one of my favorite actors. And I guess voice actors, just awesome. Uh, and I didn't learn that until, wow, it was, it was too long way, way after. So, uh, yeah, I love to see this, so let's get into it. That's loud. Tom McKay is Henry. Games like this and films and TV shows and plays all kind of start and end with a brilliant story and a brilliant script. And if you don't have those, it, it's kind of a waste of everybody's time, whatever the media is. Uh, because at the end of the day, they're designed to release people's imagination and get them excited and engaged in stories and character. Because it's not just a 90 page script that has a beginning, middle and end, but it's a whole world that can have any number of uh, certainly middles and ends and even beginnings. Uh, and I think Damn. in this instance, fortunately, That's one Henry. of the reasons I want to do it is because <laughs> I think the script is really good and the characters are brilliant, and Henry particularly is a character. That's how they did it? About. Um, and I think that's mostly because of the passion for this world uh, and these characters in the heads of the creators. Because this is a part of the world that not a lot of people know about. In no, terms. we. Like I don't. I never... Here. And it's a fascinating one and a really quite fine and, and, and exciting one. Yeah. We've got a very reliable team who know the world infinitely better than we ever could because they've been working on it for three years. And they will brief you. We'll have a briefing in the morning. They'll describe the you know, what's capture. going on in the scene, what the context is, what the, what the environment looks like. And I've just relied incredibly heavily on them. I mean, Dan particularly, who created the game, he knows the world inside out. And at the end of the day, once you've got the hilarious, you know, <laughs> like for body suits and the spots all over you and all that stuff which of course in the first instance are kind of hilarious and, and ridiculous but you, so you very cool. quickly forget those um and at the end of the day then it's just about playing a scene honestly with another actor and in that respect that's exactly the same as any other um performance i mean that's our job in a way we're professional kids who just play dressing up for a living yeah i think what's exciting about henry is that he like any great story is, is a very different man at the end of the story to the one he is at the beginning that he starts out as this young man from a very, um, you know, simple, honest, loving, warm background. It's, it, I guess, in, in this instance at least, it's his journey from boy to man. It, it, that got me really excited. I kind of, you know, the journey of the character is a relatively traditional one, actually. Boy to man. Self-discovery and learning who he is and who his family members are and all that kind of stuff. It's a very human, um, three-dimensional, credible story. Um, and it's been an amazing experience, actually. It's been, um, mostly because of the people, if I'm honest, and I'm not just saying that because you guys are here, but um, I think there's a real sense of community in the building itself. And my understanding is that uh, by, ga by gaming standards, it's a relatively small team of people. Uh, to my eye, it's not a small group of people. It's a, you know, I don't know what the numbers are, but I'd say there's at least 100 people working in this building, I think. There's a real sense of openness and warmth and support and not hierarchy, um, which is which is a fantastic thing for a working environment. So thank you to them, and I hope the players enjoy the game as much as we have making it. Oh. Oh, trust me. That's already covered. Wow. So they put the motion capture and everything into it. Uh, let's, where's a good end screen right there? Uh, go buy the game. I always say that every time, because it's, it's totally worth it. Uh, that's an interesting backstory. The, the amount of motion capture I, I saw in there is intense. Even with the doors and stuff. Oh, my God. For an in, indie developer, that that's insane. I, you get that in AAA title games, and I think, in my personal opinion, 
Kingdom Come Deliverance is a triple ta- tri- triple ta- triple A title game. Just because of the amount of work that's been put in. And the fact that you saw him doing the script right there with, with him just sitting down reading and, and, and talking out the lines and stuff. Man. I love the behind the scenes stuff. That's always been a favorite of mine. Uh, I don't know what else to say. That was just an, a very interesting thing to watch. Tom McKay, I love how he looks exactly like it. I know he's supposed to look like exactly like Henry, but he it just it really like puts it in perspective of how much work they put in to make him look the same exact. He looks just like almost the same exact as he does in game. And I like the idea from going from boy to man. That's what I'm on right now. That's that's my thing. Is making him a man, and I that's progressing. Oh, the progression on yeah, the progression on top of it is is incredible. All right, guys, I thank you guys for watching. Oh wait, oh, that's that's wrong. Leave your like em ups. Uh, putting your social medias there. Uh, sharing your social medias. Putting your daily subscription. Uh, by hitting the red button down below. Uh, any final thoughts? Tom McKay is 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 awesome. He seems like a, a cool dude, uh, and I'd love to just go up to him and be like, "Hey, Henry's come to see us." <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.